Hello everyone, this is Ogre Boy, and today I would like to do my top 10 favorite romance movies in honor of Valentine's Day. Um, number 10 is Jungle Fever, directed by Spike Lee and starring Wesley Snipes. The film follows an interracial romance that, and it, the controversy it caused back in the early 90s between both families of the people involved it it's a great movie has a lot of great acting in uh there's a lot a very good film um number nine uh is you've got mail starring tom hanks and uh meg ryan they both are excellent they have great chemistry they had worked on two other movies before and this being their last one um, it was a really good movie, had a lot of heart and um, a lot of fun to watch. Um, number eight is Brookback Mountain, um, one of the best love stories ever told. It has a great cast. Jake Gyllenhaal and Heath Ledger were perfect together. They fit their characters very well and had a great supporting cast and beautiful cinematography and directing in just an all-in-all -all great story. Um, number seven is The Notebook. It's easily the best uh, Nicholas Sparks movie. Um, the cast is excellent and they fit their characters very well. Um, the story is told really well. The, the book it's based on doesn't have as much as the movie does but it works out well um, number six is Titanic um, one of the highest grossing movies of all time I think it's actually currently the second or third highest of all time it's a great story with a uh, great cast and wonderful directing, terrific special effects that still hold up today and it's a lot of it's really entertaining and great cast yeah. number five is Pretty Woman starring uh, Julie Roberts and Richard Gere a great movie the, they work very well together and uh, the story is really sweet and the characters are really likable it the uh, rags to riches story one of the best number four is the last song another Nicholas Sparks inspired movie which in turn was actually the movie was uh, the book was based on the movie um, Miley Cyrus and Liam Hemsworth both had great chemistry and it's a lot of fun to watch uh, them two together and has a, a lot of heart and it's, it's all really fun. Um, number three is The Fault in Our Stars, which may be probably the saddest movie on this list. You know, the, the chemistry between Shailene Woodley and Ansel Elgort was, at, it was excellent and, and it stands as one of the best movies for both of the actors. They both fit their parts extremely well and worked really well together. Um, the story is really sad as they're both uh, cancer patients and of course it doesn't really have a happy ending but the movie is just really fun to watch because of the chemistry between the two leads. Um, number two is Fifty First States, one of my favorite Adam Sandler movies, probably in my top two or three of his favorite movies. The chemistry between him and Drew Barrymore is is excellent, and the movie has a lot of heart that makes you laugh and cry at times, and uh, it's really a very well made movie. Um, one of his, like I said, it's one of his best. Um, and number one is Disney's 1991 animated classic, um, Beauty and the Beast. The 
uh, well, the re the two th the 2017 remake was excellent and everything. That it just doesn't beat the original. The the all the lovable characters and music and story. It's just a lot of fun to watch. And it never gets old. Uh, I watch it all the time, uh, two or three times a year, and it just never gets old. It's one of my favorite romance movies of all time. Um, well, happy Valentine's Day, everyone, and I uh, hope you enjoy this video. Um, if you like it enough, uh, hit like and subscribe, and um, I will be doing more videos either later today or tomorrow when I can. Um, thank you very much.